Hey guys, it's Aisha here. So today we're talking about emotional incest. Yay! Learning facts is awesome. So, pretty much the child walks into the room while the parents crying or upset or looking sad or upset, pretty much. And so they feel they need to be responsible for the parents, even though they're the child. Change, right? They're switching places. The child's a child that's supposed to remain a child. So, they feel the need to help their mom and protect them. That's called emotional incest. They get stressed and everything else. So pretty much, they try their best to help their mom, but when sometimes it fails, they feel helpless and stuff. So, that's harming the child. Oh, love and see, love hugging the parents when they're crying lightly, smiling lovingly as the state. It's so... Uh, not really loving as it says or looks. Sometimes that can be bad. Actually, most of the time it's bad. So, make sure you don't get caught in emotional incest. Thank you guys.